There's a lot of negative shit going on in this world. Tyron Woody can't let a young white boy knock you out like that. Let's see, I'm gonna broke my damn ankle right there. Come on. Three of them to guard. It's just perplexing that every time I jump out the Rari, jump out the race, they're like, damn. Who do you play for? You know? Damn. That nigga ain't play no sports. The guard. I didn't play no sports to get the Rolls Royce. Rolls Royce. I didn't play no sports to get peace, prosperity, positivity, and progression to all. Beans. I didn't play no sports to get the man cheese. Yeah, I didn't play no sports. I didn't play no sports to fuck that bad bitch. I didn't play no sports to get filthy rich. I didn't play no sports to live like this. Yeah, and they want us playing ball just to get our wealth. Five years later, we broke with bad health. I'm talking no one cares, we got bad weed. I'm talking no one cares, we got mouths to feed. Yeah, we on the sideline with the pain. We can't even walk straight, we feel the pain. This be hard. Have no fears. Mr. Organic is in that car. Shoosh. Put a little extra on that motherfucker right there, man. Shout out to everybody in Organic Nation. G Squad, of course. Uh, can't forget the G Squad. <laughs> and of course, the Gargoyle Gang, the Gang, the Gang, 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 with the Gang, the Gang. It's on the mask. Make sure you go to organiclifestyle.com. Get that mask. Hey, sap it, though. Shout out to my guy, E List, man. You know, came through, made the Baraka, whatever these joints is called. Hook me up, man. It's linked below in the description. Young man, you know, locked up and still handling his business behind bars. Legendary individual, man. I appreciate you at Instagram below, man. Keep it pure, keep it positive. But anyway, yeah, so I got exclusive for you guys. You can order these right now at organiclifestyle.com. They are available for purchase, man. So, yeah, let me know how it go. If you want one, it's limited editions, man. And if you want it's a regular one or some different styles, go to my guy's Instagram and buy some from him, man. He locked up, so it'd be dope to support him. And uh, he's talented at what he do. So, but these ones is super limited edition. I'm going to get them from me. And they had an exclusive number just for you guys. So the Gargoyle Gang, you know, <laughs> War Ready Mask available for you guys. Other than that, man, I'm chilling like a villain, keeping it pure, keeping it positive, man. Waiting on my guy, uh, Killer. Gonna get some more tattoo work, add some more um, color to my neck and uh, to my chest part right here. A little dibble and dabble, man. It's keeping it progressive as ever. Hope everybody going out their way, have an organic day. That's what I need you guys to do. Um, other than that, man, make sure you guys stay on your P's and Q's of positivity. There's a lot of negative shit going on in this world. You don't want to engulf yourself into that. You know what I mean? The best thing you can do is stay positive and stay out the way. Everybody's screaming, they outside, I'm outside, I'm outside. Me, I'm inside. Fuck outside. <laughs> I stay inside, man. I stay out the way and continue to, you know, grow my greatness. The more you outside mingling with everybody, the more you subjective to bullshit to come into your energy, into your life. So I stay inside handling my business, man. You know what I mean? You gotta be vigilant. It's not about being scary, it's about being smart. You know, um, the toughest people I ever known either in jail or they did. So I'm one of the toughest people I ever known, but I'm one of the smartest too. So I emerged and grinded the two together. And so you got a gargoyle, hard and fly at the same time, you hear me? But the most important thing to do is stay out the way, stay to yourself, handle your business, and be respectable and respected and give respect. That's how you do it, man. Go out your way, give somebody a little bit of respect, man. And watch how far it takes you. You know what I mean? A little conversation helps out a lot, man. So if you got any, you know, prior transgressions for people, man, try to squash that, brother. If it's not that serious, if it ain't got to the level of somebody up out of here, you know what I mean? Go out your way to try to, you know, dilute that fire before it gets too, you know, arsoned up. It's a real serious situation that takes place once, you know, physical or somebody gets harmed or somebody loses their life, stuff like that. So I just advise everybody to stay in a positive realm, get a conversation or just, you know, agree to disagree and go your separate ways and stay out of people's way. For real, it's too much going on in this world to engulf in that, especially if you got something going on. Most people that engage into those activities, they don't have nothing going on. They're broke, they're miserable, they're out of shape. You know what I'm saying? They're sick in the mind and body. They're sick in the finances too. So why would you engage in that if you got something going on? That's why you never see Mr. Organic engaging no fuckery like that. If I gotta, you know, engage in somebody who's talking crazy to me, um, at the out of choice situation, that wasn't no, that was just, come on, man. That just clarifying shit for my people. That's it, that's all. But other than that, I do not engage in that stuff. But yeah, so that's just what I mean. It's like, people want 
negativity. But when you come from a different type of background like I do, we try to steer well, steer, steer away from it, steer clear of it as much as possible. So that's what I do, you know what I mean? Um, especially at this point in my life, I done, I done made too many business accusations and acquisitions and acquisitions and acqu acquisitions that uh, I, I can't turn around. I'm too, I'm too engulfed in the riches now. So it ain't nothing I can do to slow myself down now. So I gotta keep on going forward. So anything in the past, leave it in the past. It's nothing but positivity and progression from now on. You know what I mean? So, um, so that's what I'm saying. You'll never see me really engage in bullshit. If you see some shit about me, man, let it, let them be. People do this to get their money up, get their clicks up. That's part of YouTube. So that's why when people be like, oh man, I saw this video about you. Man, God bless them. They want to get them some revenue off the three of them name. I get it. I'm not even that big in YouTube, but if they think they can use my name for some algorithm points, go ahead. That's part of the YouTube game, man. As long as it don't come in human flesh, like I said, we good. You know what I mean? Even at that, I'm going to try to avoid it because I know what I'm capable of and I know I'm going to turn my leaves to this to the green leaf of money. So we're going to keep it over there. But other than that, people don't never worry about that shit, dog. You know what I mean? I don't, so I don't need y'all to. You know what I mean? We all about peace, positivity, progression, and uh, prosperity to all, man. You know what I mean? But we will step on some shit if we got to. But we, ain't, we, we on defense, baby. So for real, guys, I need y'all to do the same thing. So watch how I move and how I operate and I need y'all to do the same. You know what I mean? So I'm gonna get this tattoo. I'm gonna add some color to the neckery. Um, add the progression to the to the blessings. Make sure you go to organiclifestyle.com. Get the merch. I got new merch for you guys too. Got that new uh, gargoyle game varsity jacket. I actually got it upstairs with the hat. So I'm gonna show that to you also. Other than that, man, just keep progressing, man. I need everybody out here in the holiday season be able to take care of their kids, give their girlfriend, their wife, you know, your mom. Your dogs, whatever, the best presents they want for this holiday. That's what it's all about, man. So keep it cheerful. Keep it glee. You know what I mean? Don't, you know what I'm saying? Don't get down on your luck. Step your shit up. Don't get down on your luck. Step your shit up. It's here for the taking, man. It's here for everybody. You hear me? So stay positive and progressive. I need that from you guys, man. That's what we're going to do, man. But ain't nothing going to stop the revenue. We got too much of this, man. <laughs> it's too far gone. The NFT drop is coming soon. Shout out to my guy Dave Warren. Um, you saw the little um, our crumby variant, the organic kind on that fit. You know what I mean? So that's coming soon. We'll have a nice little drops with that, um, and there'll be more and more after that. So these NFTs just gonna be remarkable. Um, that's gonna put me in a whole different stratosphere. So once I tap into that and I learn more and more, I can give y'all more information. That's what it's all about. Crypto still going crazy, man. As I see, Sheep is down. So I think you guys should buy it in the red. I'm not your financial advisor. I ain't gonna tell you what to do, but I tell you about what I would do if I was you. You know what I mean? You buy when it's down, 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 down. Don't try to get it when it's up. You know what I mean? Or if you already got some and it dropped down, buy them dips so you dollar cost average so you get your money lower for how much the coin you have. So be smart. And so say it's like 000. 000. 0.35 is what you have. Now it's at 000. 000. 0.25. Buy some more and get your dollar cost down to about 25 now. So when it goes up to the 35 you already had, you make money. Then it goes to 45, you make money, go to 50. So you just gotta know those little things. Use that to your greatness. It's a blessing when that shit drop. So when it go back up, you got more fuel for the moon, baby. Buy the dips so you never slip. Stop being scared. I know you're nervous. Stop it, you know what I mean? But uh, all right, man, I'll get back to you guys in soon. And uh, make sure you add my guy, Crypto Killer, the Crypto Killer Academy right there below in the description. Add my dog. He give you more insight than I do. He don't want to give me the plays on what crypto to buy and sell, when to get it, when not to get it. And keeps me up to date with all the information, too. It's more than just buy or sell. He gives you information about the different coins and stuff like that. So that's very, very important so you know what you're getting into. So hit my dog up right there on Instagram. Join his academy. He's going to get you right. Crypto Killer. That's my dog right there. And he got some new merch and all that, too. So, so I'm saying support my guy. Um, other than that, I'm three of them. Got three rings on, bitch. Got five bracelets. And I got an AP. Cost about six D. Damn. Big, big head ass, nigga. Yeah. Sometimes you just gotta reminisce, man. The go for you manifest. You gotta reminisce where you came from, man. How did you start? I mean, listen. Working graveyard shift. Didn't have a part to pick. Yeah, it's time to reminisce. I manifested it. Gotta be honest. I knew I'd be rich. I had to go through the shit just to shine like this. Yeah, working at the Walmart. Yeah, cashier and pushing carts. That's when the hustle started. Getting rich was my target. Fresh at death every day. Deceased, deadly departed. I steal all the GTAs and sell them out in front of Target. You know what? 
My guy Killer ain't gonna be here for another 30 minutes, so fuck it. Let me just get a vlog of me talking. You know what I mean? Um, it's the holiday season, like I said in the earlier. It's time to reflect and count your blessings, man. You know? As we see, I'm at the made compound. Can never go wrong with this, you know. Had my mom's birthday here not too long ago. That was dope. And uh, I think my mom coming down for Christmas, so we'll do some cool things. You know, shout out to Champ. She went back to St. Louis for um, for Christmas and all that. Make sure you subscribe to her channel. She got some new merch and all that, too. So she's working hard. You know, that's what it's all about. It's all about putting that grind in the in the sand, you know, with your seeds and hoping they grow. But not really hoping. You got to make that shit grow for real, though. You know what I mean? Like, waiting for these handouts and waiting for that shit to progress on its own. I'm saying that machine going to goddamn take the motherfucker. What's that shit doing? Okay, cool. But, yeah, that's what it's all about, man, putting that best foot forward. Stop waiting for shit, man. Make it happen. That's what I'm doing. That's what I did. You know, um, taking more risks. Motherfuckers don't take enough risks. See, I'm going to broke my damn ankle right there because I ain't got no shoes on and shit. Twisting my damn sock up all crazy, but it's all right. It's artificial mm -hmm. turf, though. You know what I'm saying? It's the same shit the Rams play in, man. My jury on, man. I don't want to play with you niggas. Me and my Uncle Blackbeard, we looking similar. Look at the fingery, man. Hmm? Hmm? We out here, man. I just been chilling in the crib for the last couple of days, man. Sometimes I just like to do that. Because I, I, I got a crazy life that I got to maintain. I got to go, you know what I'm saying, nonstop. So when I get time to relax, I like to relax, you know. So that's what I've been doing. But tap back in you to you guys when I got something going on. So I'll give y'all an update for the week. You know, getting the tats. Dropped the Ferrari off. Still got to do the back camera. Got to be fixed on it. And also put the heat shield at the bottom. Shout out to my guys at Voodoo. So I'll be out there tomorrow handling that business. Um, working on a new podcast uh, concept too with crypto and everything like that and also business. So it's almost a playoff my um, new song, my freestyle song, Smartest in the Room. So think about a, a podcast that, you know, you talk about money and finances and just smart shit. All about being the smartest in the room and uh, have different people that you know, no financial literacy or, and on top of that too, there's different business people and different entertainers because all entertainers are basically businessmen too, for the most part. So just talking to them about their different endeavors, what they invest in, what they like, what they don't like, um, real estate, uh, uh, you know, stock, uh, crypto, NFTs, branding, products. So working on that concept too called Smartest in the Room. Yeah, but uh, the main thing I'm focused on right now is, is the NFTs, man. I think it's going to be big for me. I think it'll be big for you guys too because... You guys don't know that much about them. I know a little bit. I'm going to learn more. And the more I learn, the more I give you guys, man. But just be on the lookout for that first drop I do. Make sure you subscribe. I mean, not subscribe. Add this Instagram below to the um, or Orcon drop for me and my guy Dave. Um, and I want everybody to, you know, follow that Instagram page. And uh, I need everybody right there because we're doing numerous drops throughout the year. And I want you guys connected to that so I can feed y'all greatness. And it's going to come with a lot of different things. I'm um, working on new music too, new music coming. You know what I'm saying? Got the Gargoyle Game Boogies with Xena, Stink Girl. Uh -huh. She bad, super bad. Look at her. Shout out to my guys, the mess, the mess, the Blacksican Bullies. You know what I'm saying? Look at this girl. She bad. She's smart though, look. Come on, man. That's a Merle right there, man. Try color Merle, man. Stop playing me. Did I say that right? I don't know. Look at her. <laughs> Just a Merle. A Zonic Bully Merle. Not try color. Shout out to my guy Mike. But uh, she's smart though. Sit. Move, Bina. Sit. Sit. Good girl. Shake. Stop. Not you. You messing up everything, Bina. You know you know this already. Move. Shake. Now go on. I ain't talking to you. Sit. Bina, move the hell out the way. Sit. Sit. Good girl. Shake. Ah, shake. Yeah, come on now. One day got a spot, man. Smartest in the room. But yeah, man, Um, I was getting a jacuzzi yesterday, chilling. And you know what I'm saying? Overlooking the whole goddamn ocean, the Pacific. Such a miraculous situation, man. Got my dogs hiding. Let's go. Go on, on them. Come on, dear. Let's go. She always do that though. I don't know why I be running. She wanna bite my goddamn leg every time. 
But that's one of my workouts I do. I'm running around the, the pool, run up and down the stairs. When I don't feel like going to the gym, gotta do more of that. I do my push-ups, punch my punching, punch my punching man, the Bob. Speaking of that, Tyron Woodley. Come on, champ. I know you want the money, so I ain't gonna, we all need money. So I ain't gonna, you know what I'm saying, shit on another black man. But man, let us down. But get your money though, for sure. First and foremost. But brother, can't let a young white boy knock you out like that, huh? Shit is embarrassing. Golly. Not in front of my deuce and all that. Whoo! Flat line two, land on the face. With the feet to the side like that, motherfucker, feet to the side like a wicked wish of the West. Feet like this, damn. Come on, brother. But I know you got a bag, and that's what it's all about. But we must ask ourselves is the bag worth the legacy? Is the bag worth your pride? Is the bag worth your everything? I think it is. Shit, <laughs> me. Yeah, get that money, brother. You know what I'm saying? A little embarrassment ain't hurt, kill nobody. Shit. And being broke wood. So I feel you, brother. I know you got five kids and shit, so salute you, brother. It is what it is. And the thing about it, anybody can lose a fight. You know what I'm saying? So don't get it misconstrued. One hit could knock anybody out. So that's why it's so dangerous when you have interactions with people. People are like, oh, stand your ground laws in different states. Yeah, because one hit could kill a nigga, man. So imagine you hit somebody like he got hit, fall on your face flat, and nigga two foot, baboon, monkey stump on top of your damn head. Then, then what? Nigga, so don't touch me. <laughs> Straight up. But, but yeah, brother, it, it takes courage to get in there and fight. But nah, fuck that, nigga. I'm not losing to nobody. I'm just gonna, I'm three of them. I'm too, I'm too sturdy with these motherfuckers, man. So I, it was embarrassing, but it is what it is. Nigga got his back. Salute him. We ain't gonna, we ain't gonna shit on him. Another black man like that, it just ain't the thing to do. Is it funny? Yeah. Is it embarrassing? Yeah, that's life. I got plenty of embarrassing, funny things happen to me in life, you know what I'm saying? But I ain't never been knocked out. No, sir, ain't gonna happen. <laughs> I know I keep my distance, nigga. But shout out to him. Shout out to Darren Williams, too, the uh, basketball player, you know. One, one win for the for the Hoopers, you know what I'm saying? Beat the uh, football nigga, oh. Frank. Oh, what you doing? Motherfucker. <laughs> she rolled over, scared on her. But, uh, yeah, calm down a little child. Roll over now. Playing it all a little scared. Bark out it. Playing dead. <laughs> but yeah, that's what it's all about, man. Uh, so update on that. Tom Ron Woodley, not that cold, embarrassing, but it's all right. You got your money. I get it, brother. <laughs> you gave up your legacy for the money. It's all good, my nigga. I, hey, brother, get your bag. Um, but you gotta know too, guys, that like it's weight classes. Like Jake Paul probably walk around 230, two something on a normal basis. So he already walks around at a heavier weight. Now, Tyron Willie, he used to fight like at Welter with that thing like that, so it's about like 175. So he probably do walk around at 190, but that's still under 200 something. So when he get up to 190, he's really at an out of shape weight. You see what I'm saying? So it's like he a smaller person at an out of shape weight fighting a bigger person in the in shape weight. You gotta know this shit now. It's all about matchups, but um, uh, and you and smart people know that about weight classes and everything. That's why they got weight classes, but. Other than that, man, hey, it is what it is, man. I'm just giving y'all a little bit of dialogue, making the content for y'all motherfuckers because I ain't been on there for a little while, so I'm going to chop this up, give y'all one vlog, then the next vlog, you're going to see me get my tattoo on my neck. Other than that, man, keep it pure, keep it positive, Mr. Organic. Make sure you go to OrganicLifestyle.com, get the merch. Believe yourself, work hard. Don't give up, don't give a fuck. That's what I'm telling you to do. That's what it's all about, baby. If you want rings on your fingers, you want bracelets on your wrist, you want APs on your wrist, you got to grind, bitch. Yeah, and this shit don't go nowhere. People are like, oh, you spend money on jewelry, nigga. This is going, and it's still money. This is look, but this ain't going nowhere. I go cash this in right now for the same bag I put on it. For the most part, it might go up, and this definitely gonna go up, bitch. So I ain't losing nothing. I invested in myself. I like to look good, feel good, be great. Whatever you like, you like. Huh? This dog costs a Rolex, man. You hear me? This dog costs more than you. Look at that, man. Look at that. Come on, man. Look at that. Look at it. Costs more than you, boy. You know what I'm saying? That's valuable. So, man, that's what it's all about, man. I just want to come tap on my people and tell them I appreciate you guys. You know, it's going to be a legendary, historical, you know, Christmas for me and my family. 
So all, all thanks to you guys supporting the brand, supporting the, um, the person that I am. And uh, I wouldn't be here without you guys, but I want to first and foremost thank God because he gave you guys good taste to know what I am. You hear me? <laughs> I was going to make it some way or another anyway, but he gave me this platform to talk to you guys in this way. So we're going to go ahead and keep on pursuing our greatnesses. That's what I need y'all to do. That's what I did. You hear me? Uh, and now keep it pure, keep it positive. Mr. Organic, I'm just talking a little shit, man. You hear me? There go my dog. There go Xena, the guard girl princess. Add her on Instagram. There go Athena, the old lady. Uh-huh. They're both chewing. They both eating good. Are you? AP. Three of them. Gone. Yeah. yeah. See my wrist on freeze. Yeah. See my wrist on freeze. Yeah. See my neck on freeze. Yeah. See my neck on freeze. Yeah. You ain't getting none of these, though. You ain't getting none of these. Yeah. Pocket filled with G's. Yeah. 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 I ain't talking about Gucci. Yeah. I ain't talking about Louis.